Qué bonita camisa, Tichen. No se le escucha, Tichen. ¿No? Yes. Ok, good evening. Good evening, Tichen. You like the color of my blouse. Yes, yellow. My yellow. favorite color. Really? I didn't know it was your favorite color. Yes. Ok. Nice. <laughs> my, my mom doesn't like yellow. But I think it's a, it's a color that makes you feel happy. Cabal. Yes. Mm -hmm. So here we go again. We're going to start again. Uh, what did you do these days that you didn't have class? Don't tell My me work, what you're doing. <laughs> work. Working, work, work, work. <laughs> Hello, Marco. Okay. Hello, how are you? I'm Hi, good. Hi, everybody. Uh, Hi, Marco. Hey, Alfredo, ¿cómo siguió? ¿Cómo habrá seguido Alfredo de la tos? Nice. Oh. Good evening, Hi, Marlon. Marlon. Al fin se dejó ver Alfredo. Yeah, yeah. Hi, good evening, people. <laughs> good evening. How are you? Good evening, Marlon. How's it going? We are ready. Oh, what is that? That's nice. <laughs> I think that next time could be the same classmate. Yeah, you have two new classmates. No, it's okay. Okay, two new in the You're group. Welcome. But then the same, the same ones. Don't worry. <laughs> and Alfredo, what can you tell us? How do you feel? You survived. Yes, I survived. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it's good to, to have you again. In my in my class as my group of students. Mm -hmm. Is it raining out there where you live? No, in Congo City, no. No, not in Santa Ana, okay. It was raining here, but it was like early in the afternoon, but not right now. Thanks God. Because it's, I mean, we, it, the, the internet goes crazy when it's raining hard. Teacher, I couldn't connect to WhatsApp. Oh, you need the link. They send me a new link, but even it doesn't work. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see if I can send it once more. <laughs> Try with that one. I already sent it to the WhatsApp group. Try it. And you let me know if you can. Okay, people, it's time to start. Good evening, Jasmine. 
Okay, guys, it's eight o'clock, so it's time to start the class. Let me take the attendance first. Remember that you have to uh, turn off, turn on your camera to stay present or here. Aha, uh -huh. so the first in the group is Alvarino Davides Castillo. Present. Very good. Alfredo Rodas. Present. Amilcar Cañengues. Carlos Walberto Rodríguez. Cristina Romero. Domingo González. Fátima Portillo. José Matías Lemos Ramírez. Present, present. Marco David Velázquez. Present. Marlon Cardón. Present. Mauricio Majano. Maideli Díaz. Present. Oh, it is here. Nancy Rodríguez. Katia Maritza. Salvador Escobar. Sandra Velázquez. Víctor David. Walter Daniel. Uh, William Eduardo Pérez. Jasmine Melanie Lemos. Present. Oh, I see Carlos is now connected. Carlos Rodríguez. Yes, teacher. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening. Okay, guys, let me um, show you the presentation. Let me share with you the presentation. And please let me know if you can see it. Okay. Can you see my presentation now? No. Not yet. Yes. Now yes. you can. Yes. Yes, yes. Good. Good. So, guys, um, you see, you are now in the Bexy Model 4. Congratulations. And, well, for, for the students who are new in the group, my name is Rocio Stephanie Chicas. I am an English teacher and I'm currently working for uh, Oportunidades Program and also for Indes Corporativo. Okay. You know that for this, um, for this class, when you connect to the platform, you have to include your full name. And now you have the, the instruction that you have to, uh, you have to put your full name with your first and second name or middle name and your two last names, okay? And if you are gonna be just hearing the class, you have to write oyente and then your full name. Uh, you, you need to have your camera on during all the class. Try to minimize the, the, the noises mm -hmm. from your nearby. And obviously you have to participate actively during the class. That's very important in the breakout rooms and also as a whole class. What else? Okay, now uh, remember that you have to be in the class. The attendance has to be 100%. And uh, the attendance is taken not only present, but also you have to complete the two hours, okay, the two hours class. I'm going to take the attendance at eight o'clock, 9 p.m. and five minutes before 10. 
Okay, you have to say present or here and you need to have your camera on. Okay, remember that you have every participant is assigned 10 minutes at the end of each class to give you support. Okay, and per permissions are not available. You know, it's very important your attendance to the class. And in the platform, you have to have the 80% in homework and evaluations to complete the, the online course. Uh, you know that after each class, you have a homework. For example, this is the class number one. You, need, you are going to have homework number one. You need to have all the homework complete before each Friday. Okay, at the end of each uh, week, because uh, that is sent to in support weekly. The last date uh, to complete the midterm is Wednesday, September 29th. Okay, and the last date to complete the final exam is Wednesday, October the 13th, before midnight. Mm -hmm. Uh, does everybody have the handbook? Do you have the book, the online book? Guys, does everybody have the handbook, the, the book, the material? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay, yes. that's great. In case you, you don't have it, I can give it to you. I can send it to you. Okay, you just need to ask for it or let me know. Okay, if there is too much noise nearby, well, we have the bottom mute. Mm -hmm. We have the camera, we have the chat. I, I sometimes uh, ask you to, to share your sentences or your participations in the chat. Uh, it's important for me that you also participate with your classmates in the break rooms. And if you need help, you can ask for it. Okay, so let's start with the first class. Who can tell me what's the topic of today's class? Who can tell me? How to use count and non account nouns? Thank you, Fatima. Welcome to the class. It's, I'm glad to see you again. <laughs> And you look very nice tonight. <laughs> okay, and the class objective, can somebody read it, please? Matias, please. Yes. Uh, objective. Participants will be able to complete a set of questions using count and no count question correctly by working in groups. Thank you so much. So we are starting this unit, which is about purchasing. Purchasing means buying, buying things, acquiring a product. So in this class, we're going to learn the difference in English. We use on words or phrases to refer to count nouns, los contables, sustantivos contables, and the non-count nouns, which are uh, the nouns or sustantivos that you can't count with your fingers, right? So we are going to learn that this evening. The agenda in the, okay, we have these activities in the agenda. I would like Alba to read, please, the activities that I prepared for this class. Agenda, what would go a shopping? Activity one, feature of products. Activity two, call a no call a note. Activity three, how much or how many? Wrap up. Excellent. Thank you so much. Good pronunciation. Yes, we're going to learn about that. The warm up eh, is about um, a discussion about your shopping habits. 
So let's start. Going shopping. I have some questions, guys. These are the questions that you are going to discuss in your group. The first question is, do you like going shopping? You can say, yes, I do, or no, I don't. Second question, what do you usually shop for? Mm -hmm. So in this case, you can say, well, I usually shop for food, uh, clothes, shoes, or gadgets. So you have to tell your classmates about what are the, the things that you usually buy or that you shop for. What are gadgets? I, I put here this picture. You can see those electronical devices are gadgets. The next question is, what was the last thing you bought? And you can answer, the last thing I bought was, in my case, the last thing I bought was a washing machine. Why, teacher, why did you buy that? Well, I bought it because I needed it to wash my clothes since I don't have a lot of time to do it. So I need help. And how much did it cost you? Oh, it cost me a lot of money, $490. And where did you buy it? I bought it at a store called Tropigas. <laughs> this is not a TV commercial, but that is the information. Okay, so this is the example, and you are going to discuss these questions as a group in the breakout room. So I'm, in this moment, I'm going to assign you to the rooms, and please, um, uh, participate. In this moment, if you want, before I send you to the groups, you can take a screenshot, a picture of the questions. Okay, at the count of three. One, two, three. Ready? Okay. So, um, in the groups, with your classmates, you are going to discuss those questions. Do you have any doubt or any questions before you start in the groups? No. Yes, no, maybe. Speak now or... <laughs> okay. Repeat the question, teacher. Okay, my question was: do you, question. do you have any doubts or questions about the activity, about what you are going to do? Alguna pregunta de lo que van a hacer? Or is it clear? Um, vamos a responder las preguntas que ya mencionó antes. Exactly, in the group, okay. in the rooms, okay? Yes. With the people in the group. Okay. okay, that's why I said that you could take a, a screenshot or a picture of the question so you can have this there. Uh -huh. Okay. Good. Sí, sí, América. Les pedí que, que no, tomaran no. Una, una foto o una captura. Yes, yes, okay. yes, yes. Great. Ya la tengo, ya tengo la. Nice, very nice. Okay, so I'm going to create the, the, the groups. Ok, guys. Hola, teacher. ¿Será que me puede, me puede explicar un poquito? No le entendí muy bien. Es que estoy ah. aquí con fallas todavía acomodándome. Ah, ok, Yasmin. Sí, les mencionaba que van a discutir las preguntas que puse en la presentación. De hecho, también se las envié eh, en el grupo de WhatsApp. Uh -huh. ¿Grupo de Entonces van a, van a hablar sobre esas preguntas que habla de, de em, qué es lo que usted usualmente compra, 
eh, qué fue lo último que compró, a dónde, cuánto le costó. Sobre eso van a, van a platicar. Obviously in English. Ok, guys, please enter to the groups. Enter the rooms, please. Hello, Salvador. Teacher. Yes. I Hello, Salvador. It's good to see you again. How are you? Uh, hello, teacher. I'm fine. Okay, uh, that's great. Gracias. Thank you, teacher. Thank you for your compression. Understanding. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and William? William, are you there? Hola. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Good evening, Tisha. Este, sí, Tisha, eh, todavía no he caído muy bien. Acabo de venir de trabajar y me acabo de conectar a, ah, okay. a la clase. Ah, ok. Ok, good. Are you already in the group? In the WhatsApp group? Sí. Ok, good. Sí, ya vi. Ya vi. The questions, you can find the questions there in the, in the group. So I think Alfredo sent the, the, the questions. Uh -huh. So you have them there. So while you get ready, I'm going to um, Okay, I'm going to start discussing the questions with Salvador. Do you like going shopping, Salvador? Can you please activate your microphone, please? Because I don't hear you. Okay, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Uh, no, I don't, teacher. You don't like going shopping? No. Really? Why? Uh, because no more money. Oh. No, no, I don't. Have, I don't have money. Oh yeah, that's the bad <laughs> thing about going shopping. That you spend all your money. Okay, but there are things that we have to buy. For example, the food. We need to buy the food because we eat every day. <laughs> so, where do you usually buy your food? Your food. Uh, in the market, uh, in the supermarket, uh, uh, in la tiendita, in the store near your house. <laughs> in, in the supermarket. In and, the supermarket. Okay. In, in the mercado, como se dice. In the market. In the market. Okay. Okay. In or is or a street market <laughs> or el mercado de la calle, street market. <laughs> <laughs> market okay uh could, do you remember salvador what was the last thing you bought um uh, a 
A notebook. A notebook. Yeah. That was the last thing you bought. Okay. And why? Why did you buy a notebook? Se llama. No recuerdo el nombre, teacher. ¿Por qué? Why did you buy a notebook? Ah, uh, because I, I I will I will have a class. Oh, because you need it for your classes. Okay. And how much? How much did you pay for it? Uh, how much did it cost you? Um two um two dollars. Two dollars. A little bit expensive. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and where did you buy it? Where? Where did you buy it? Um, in the market. In the market. Okay, good. <laughs> Very good, <laughs> Salvador. Okay, nice. William, are you ready? Well, when William is ready, Salvador, you ask William the questions, okay? Okay, teacher. I will go over checking other groups, other students. Oh. William is no longer connected. Maybe he had a problem, but maybe he will, will get back soon. Okay, teacher. Okay? Okay. Yeah. The phone. The uh, your phone is it's broke. Uh, it, no, it's como broken. se dice? How do you say viejo? It's a uh, long it's old. old. What? Is, it's old. what? Old. It's old. Uh, come on, come on, come on. All, all, all. Oh, uh, how do you repeat? Please. O L D. Oh yes, yes, yes. Oh, oh, yes. O L D. Okay, okay. In my case, mm, the last, the last, uh, buy is um. The last thing I bought. See, the last thing I bought is, uh, I don't remember. Um, uh, the last, you say, uh, food, food in the supermarket. You bought food in the supermarket. No, <laughs> I'm thinking about the, uh, the mean, algo sobresaliente, the ride of my car. La llanta de mi carro. The I wheel of your car. Okay, nice. Okay. Yes. The last time I was. Was. The last. Yo lo último que compré. Yo lo último que compré. Ay. Hi, teacher. Hello. ¿Cómo Hello, se dice bolsa cartera? Bag. bag, bag, a bag. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Was that the last thing you bought? Yes, I do. I'm sorry, Domingo. Me puso lista. Tengo problemas con la con la computadora. Ah, sí, no se preocupe. Es que me robaron la nueva y me quedé con la viejita. Se la robaron. Sí. Paz, ¿cómo dijo que se pronunciaba cartera? Bag. Um, bag. Bag. No, no es igual a la cual es de chivo. <risa> ah. Wallet, Wallet es billetera. Ah, billetera. Es como la, la billetera de un hombre. Wallet. 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 Uh -huh. Wallet. Entonces la mujer sería Bab. Una cartera dijo, vea. Or Pors. También puede ser Pors. P-U-R-S. ¿Y, y, y cuando dice bolsa de mujer. 
Bag or purse? Purse is spelled P-U-R-S-E. Hi, Deli. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do you feel better now? Yeah, I have better. My oh, I see. <laughs> now it's not, it's not invisible, student. <laughs> The mysterious, the mysterious um, yeah. student. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're so enferma. Don't worry. Estaba en cuarentena, en serio. Mm -hmm. Yeah, don't, don't worry. I know. Alfredo was sick also a long time. But, but now yeah, he's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Pero yeah. <laughs> Safe and sound. Salmos y salvos. Safe and sound. <laughs> okay, I think we're going. Did you already discuss the questions? The three of you could speak about it or not yet? Solo vamos a contestar las preguntas, ¿verdad, teacher? De la... Sí, ya, ya de la... le contestaron los tres. O sea, una respuesta a cada uno tiene que ser. Uh -huh. Porque yo se la voy preguntando ahorita a Maideline. Después ella me tiene que preguntar a mí. O a Domingo. O ¿Cómo sería? Ajá, usted a, ah. a Maideline, Maideline a Domingo y Domingo a usted. Ajá, porque yo le estoy preguntando ahorita a Maideline. Ah, sí. oh, ya. A tener pero, diferentes respuestas. Sí, sí. Mire, yo le digo Maideline, pero no sé si es Maideline o or, or Maideline. Así, cabalito, my deli. My deli. My deli. Ah, mire qué interesante. Acento okay. lleva, tilde no lleva, lleva acento nada más. En la, en la última sílaba, my deli. En la última I, exacto. Ah, ok, ok. Now I will try to pronounce it correctly. My deli. It's a nice name. Okay. Well, no, it's not problem, teacher. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> Hello, Domingo. Hello, Cristina. Hello, Cristina. Oh, Domingo, you have two, two devices. <laughs> okay. Cristina, are you there? Cristina, hello. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Okay. Very good. So I would like to hear from you. 
the, the answers of the questions, okay? The first question is, do you like going shopping? No, I don't. Yes, I like. I guess Fatima loves going shopping. Yes, I <laughs> yes. I think that women tend to like going shopping more than the men. Is that true? I think it's true. You think so? <laughs> men are both. How do you say boring? <laughs> ah, they don't like to work. Mm -hmm. What like do you to have to say shopping. in your defense? That it's true. It's true, man. <laughs> <laughs> yes, absolutely. Time, I absolutely no. agree. <laughs> okay. I just buy the, the necessary things. And for if example, I don't need it, I don't go out. For example? Maybe food, food or things to work or clothes or personal and things. no more. Yes, and of it. course. Okay. That it's all. That's all. <laughs> Good. And can somebody tell us about the last thing you bought? Salvador was telling me that the last thing he bought was a notebook for his class. <laughs> yes, and, teacher. Yeah, can you tell your classmates where you bought it and how much it cost? No, no le escucho muy bien. Where did you buy your notebook and how much you paid for it? Uh, I que si cuánto me costó? Yes. Yeah, the cost. It cost okay. It cost me 2 dollars. Okay, good. 2 dollars. <laughs> 2 dollars, okay. Can somebody else share with the class that about the last thing you bought? What was it? Where did you buy it? And how much? Did it cost you? Ay, ¿por qué están de tímidos hoy? Okay. I remember the last boat, uh, the last shop is uh, to, to tire for my cars. Okay. In the coat is was it was a uh, $100. For the we, two of uh, them? I bought or, uh, or two, each? Two, the pairs. Okay. okay, the pair of no. the tires? The pair. Okay. Yes, uh, but it's necessary for the car. Yeah. I mean, those In are... My security. Exactly. Your personal... Security, okay. And where did you buy them? In Importadora Ramirez, Ciudad Merlot. Nice, okay. TV commercial. <laughs> no, <laughs> just kidding. Okay, yes. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, guys, thank you for sharing with the class. Let's continue with the next part. Now you are going to learn a vocabulary important vocabulary. In the, in the workplace, uh, the, the company also purchases uh, some products. And when they purchase some products, they take into account some characteristics or features of products, okay? Which are these features? Like size, weight, price, dimensions, battery life, storage, function, or warranty, okay? Can you please repeat after me? Size. 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 
Wait. 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 Price. Price. Dimensions. Dimension. Dimension. Battery life. Battery life. Battery life. Storage. 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 Function. 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 Warranty. 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 Okay. Now, please take a moment uh, to read the, uh, the descriptions and then you have to match the word with the correct definition. Okay, for example, the first says measurements or proportions of some kind. A promise to repair or replace something within a period of time. Ay, ahí lo <laughs> See, a measure of battery performance and longevity. B, a thing overall dimension or magnitude. E, the space available for retention of something. F, a body's relative mass or the quantity contained by something. The amount of money required or paid for something. H, practical use or purpose in design. Okay, what is the first one? Size. Maybe letter F. A body's relative mass or the quantity contained by something. <clears throat> Do you letter agree? With is letter E. Letter, letter E. e. The space. B. Wait, wait. Letter B is wait. Letter E. Sorry, that was the, the second one. Oh, I get it. I mean, I'm confused now. So size. Better be teacher. I think overall dimension or magnitude. Okay. Cool. No, we are gonna see number two. Wait. The F. The space. F. Okay. A body's relative mass oh. or the quantity contained by something. Okay. Good. Price. That's easy. Energy. Energy. The amount of money required. Exactly. Dimensions or dimensions. I see it's letter A. Letter A. Okay, measurements or proportions of some kind. Story, oh, sorry, battery life. Let us see. E. A measure of battery performance and longevity. Storage. Letter e. e. The space available for retention of something. Function. Maybe A. Mm -hmm. uh, letter H. H. Practical use or purpose in design and warranty. Letter B. Letter B. The Letter promise B. to repair or replace something in a period of time. Exactly. Now, guys, can you please match what well, you can see here the pictures and you can tell me? I'm, I'm going to try to move. Let me see if I can. Mm -hmm. eh, eh. Oops, sorry guys. I want to show you. Aha, uh -huh. you have. I'm gonna 
And here, select the picture and you tell me what it represents. For example, this one. Size, weight, price, dimensions, battery life, storage, feature, storage. storage. It's a storage, exactly, a storage. What about this one? Maybe nice. dimensions. Dimensions, Size. very good. And this? The warranty. Warranty, warranty. warranty. two years warranty, okay. My washi the, the washing machine that I just bought has five years warranty. What about this one? What? Better, better life. The function. Functions, exactly. I put this picture here because it's a, a cell phone, for example, has many functions. It could, you can use it as a camera, as a music player, uh, to- Video player. Yeah, the email. Game. Games, exactly. <laughs> a lot of things like a notebook also. Organizer, calendar, watch, and many functions. Okay, what about this thing? The weight. Right. The weight, exactly. This is a weighted scale. And this? Price. The price. 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 And what about price. this? The side. The side. Okay. Yeah, these are some close tags, like extra, extra large size, extra large size, large size, a medium size, small size, and extra small size. Hello, Alfredo's baby. We can see Alfredo's baby. What's her name, Alfredo? What's your name, baby? What's your name? What's your name, baby? What's your name, baby? ¿Cómo se llama usted? Le da pena. ¿Cómo te llamas? No, mi Rora. No. Can you repeat? Rosmi Rora. Rosmi Rora. Ah, Rosmi. Oh, nice to meet you, Rosmi. Okay, <laughs> and uh, what about this picture? Battery life. The battery life. Okay, good. So these are the features of products. Um, I can hear some dogs barking. I don't know where exactly, but. Okay, let's try not to, let's try to avoid or minimize the noise, the, the background noise as much as we can. Okay, uh, now here we have some questions that you need to ask your partners. How many products does your workplace buy and which ones are they? Which products does your company or workplace buy or purchase. Number two, approximately how many units do they buy of it? And number three, how much money do you think they spend? So right now you are going to ask your partners and write the answers. So once more, I'm going to uh, send you into the breakout rooms, you ask and answer the questions, and don't forget to write your classmates' answers, okay? Write your classmates' answers. Ready? Domingo, are you ready to ask and answer the questions? Sorry. 
<laughs> Don't worry, Marlon. Okay. Carlos, are you ready to ask and answer questions? Ask and answer. For answer, teacher. <laughs> uh, um, how many products that your workplace buy? This, this one? Yeah, those questions. Are you ready to answer the questions in your group? Ah, in my group. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. You are ready. Vaya, los voy a mandar a los grupitos y contestan las preguntas y escriben las respuestas que le den sus compañeros. ¿Ok? Ok. Yes, teacher. Yes, Ok, yes, teacher. <laughs> Okay, Domingo and Jasmine. Hola, Jasmine. Productos. Algo así como cuántos productos compras. Ajá. Hello, teacher. Hello, baby. Ah, I see. Ayuda, teacher. How? <laughs> yes, that's why I'm here. Tell me. Este. Yo voy a escribir la, la respuesta de mi compañero de las tres questions. Exactly. Ok. And it's Pero, about eh, the questions are about the workplace, about your work. Ok. They are Pero no questions about trabajo. your work. Uh -huh. eh. How much money do you think they spend? Okay. En mi caso de, de maquila, digámoslo así, sería como como qué tan como cuántos productos or materials. Oh, oh, oh. Ok. Pero es porque el, que la empresa compra algo así. Bye. Exactly. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, ok. Ok. Y el otro, un aproximado de unidades que compra para, para hacer eso o para hacer. Exactly, of the products or materials that your company buys. Teacher. Y en mi caso, que no, que no vendemos productos así, sino que vendemos nada más 
créditos. Servicios. Oh, ok, you sell services. Uh -huh. Ok, but maybe in every um, company they have to buy some products. In my case, for example, that I work for, a, for like a school, but they purchase or they buy paper. Uh, mm -hmm. ink for the printers, uh, books, and, uh, and now they are uh, buying a lot of, you know, alcohol and also toilet ya paper, soap. Okay, and so in, in your case, Salvador, I guess in your company they also buy paper or products like computers. Computer. Computer. Uh, print. A printer, computers, cell phones. So, yeah, in some companies they give personal cell phones to, to the employees. Well, es, no como que facilita, es como que le facilita a la empresa para que haga su trabajo, algo así. Ah, ok. Exactly. Nada. <risa> <risa> ah, ok. Ok, teacher. Mire, pero en su trabajo, do they use headphones or computers or how, how do you do your work? Um, ¿Es, en, ¿Es en oficina o tiene que salir usted? Es al campo. Oh. ¿Usted visita clientes? Sí. Pero los clientes te lo da la empresa, él, ella te da las direcciones. No, los tienes que hacer. ¿En no qué da, trabaja? No le dan un celular. No, teacher. Ay, no dan nada. <risa> <risa> ok. Oh, you okay. can ask Victor. Victor is the, is the boss. He's the owner of his own company. Ask him what he has to buy. <risa> Los compañeros, si, si es una financiera que trabaja, supongo que le dan libretas o, o tarjetas para que lleven los controles de los cobros de los clientes. Un libro, o sea, es lo un libro. Okay. Y también las empresas que gastan en insumos para limpieza uh -huh. y los mantenimientos. Victor, I just have a question. I mean, it's not about the class, but it's about, you know. Um, we are coming from the east. From the hospital. Really? Yeah. You have your baby? Todavía. Not yet. I can't believe you. Not yet. Oh. Okay. Yet. And Sandrita, how is she? Ah, acá está, ya nos incorporamos a la clase. Venimos llegando apenas. Okay. <laughs> okay, that may be difficult. Okay, continue, guys. Continue. Please. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Fatima. I'm sharing my, my answer by chat because William had a problem with his internet. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Are you about to finish? Yes. Okay. Yes, I, I send my answer. You already sent your answers, okay. Nice. Good.
dicho material de computadoras se diría como dijo en la anterior conversación gauge o computer accessory yeah you can say like com computer gadget or computer accessories both ways are correct gadgets gadgets Mm -hmm. Gadgets is the Gadgets for computers okay, or, accessor or accessories for computers. <clears throat> accessories for computers. Okay, guys, I would like someone okay. to share the questions. Do you remember the questions? The first one is How many products does your workplace buy? In which I buy, I bought the, um, the lunch, the breakfast, and sometimes anything, uh, groceries or a snack. Okay, so those so are the- spend that. <laughs> The time in the in the day <laughs> at work. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> to take it easy, <laughs> to make it more enjoyable. Okay, thank you, Mirka. So those are the things you buy in your workplace. But what about the products that the company buys? Uh, I guess to the personal boss. Lo que gastaba diariamente, pero de mi okay. de personal. Uh -huh, exactly. And what about the company? What products does the company or the workplace buy? Product, teacher. exactly. Teacher, o sea, que quería que habláramos eh, a nivel de empresa. Exactly. <ríe> Nosotros con Amilcar lo hablamos a nivel personal. Ah. Entonces, yo, puedo, yo, yo no, por lo menos en el caso de, de, de él y yo fue así personal, pero yo le preguntaba ¿va? de que si, era, si podíamos poner en cuanto a empresa. ¿va? Entonces deducimos, deducimos que era a nivel personal, entonces lo, lo hicimos a nivel personal. Yes. <laughs> okay, but the good the thing is that you practiced. Okay. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. The good thing that you were finally... Okay. Can somebody tell me about their company or their workplace? So many products that you workplace by paper uh, me teacher okay Fatima. Um, the company where i where i work um i think they bought approximately um, 10 Se me fue. Ten, ten thousand units. Ten thousand. Units. Units. Um, the things that they bought are um, fabric, accessories, packing materials, um, maintenance materials, in industrial machines. Um, a spare part for machines, a cleaning, cleaning material could be. Or products. Food. And also, papelería, teacher. Do you say papelería? Paper. Papers. Papers. I think that that is the most common things that they bought. Okay, that um, they buy, that mm -hmm. they usually buy, and how much money do you think they spend? 
I think they they spend every month around four hundred. No, no, no. Yes, four hundred dollars. Four hundred dollars. No, four thousand. Sorry. Four thousand dollars. Forty no forty thousand forty thousand forty thousand dollars forty thousand cuatrocientos mil dicho ah forty thousand cuatrocientos mil that is four hundred thousand four hundred thousand forty thousand four hundred cuatrocientos thousand four hundred thousand dollars four that four hundred thousand dollars okay nice um thank you salvador for reminding me that i have to take the attendance it's already nine o'clock so please say present or here okay let's start with yes. albarinora este alfredo alexander present amilcar cañengues present teacher Carlos Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Cristina Romero. Cristina Romero. Present. In the chat. In the chat, okay. present. Domingo Alexander. Present, teacher. Fátima Portillo. Present Matías Lemus. I am here. Marco Velázquez. Present teacher. Marlon Cardona Valencia. Present. Mauricio Majano. Present teacher. Maideli Díaz. Present teacher. Nancy Rodríguez. Rocío Martínez, Salvador Escobar, en Sandra Velázquez, present teacher, Víctor, present, Walter González. William Pérez. Present. Present. Okay, thank you. Good. So now, guys, let's continue with the topic. And you? And me? I'm so sorry, Jasmine. You, I think you're the last. <laughs> yeah, Jasmine, Melanie, Lemus. I'm sorry, Jasmine. I'm so sorry. Teacher. Teacher. Yes, Amilka. Uh, I don't have uh, the number of group the WhatsApp. Oh. And okay. I don't. I don't have to to the password or. Or uh, link to the to the platform. To the platform. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna give you my my number and a, my and you can write to me, okay? And I can share with you the information. Yes. That you need, okay? Can you please write down my number? Anyways, I'm gonna also do it here in the chat. Oh, Cristina has a problem with the microphone, okay. So this is my number, Mr. Cañengues. My, your, your number, the phone? Yes, my cell phone number, and you can write to me there, and you and I will send you the information that you need. Okay. 
Okay, guys, now let's get into the big topic of this class, count and non-count nouns. Okay, here you can see some, uh, some themes. For example, we have, uh, what well, I have here, water, butter, books, people, computer, cell phone, sugar, money, time, tomatoes, restaurant, pizza, pupusas, tortillas, bread, rice, and beans. Uh, can you tell me which do you think are nouns that we can count? You can count them, one, two, three, four, five, etc. And which are nouns that we could not count like that? We could not say one of these or two of these. Okay. For example, if like, the first thing we have here is the pizza. Is oh. it count or non-count? Yes. Count. count. Oh. Ah, so you can say pizza or you or also you can say pizzas, right? You can say one or two or three or four pizzas. Nice. Okay, what about rice? This is rice. Not count. Uh, it's not count. Not count. Not count. Not count. Why? Not count. <laughs> because there are a lot of uh, rice. Exactly. And you cannot count one <laughs> rice, two rice, three. One, one rice, two rice, three rice. <laughs> rice. You can when you get five, away. Yeah, it's very difficult to count, so it's non-count. What about the sugar? No count. No count. What about beans? No count. It's non-count too. What about cell phones? Count. Count. How many cell phones can you see in this picture? Exactly. Three, four, five. Six. Six cell phones. Mm -hmm. Six what cell about phone. books? Don't. Count. Ah, yeah. Don't. How many books are here? Three. Three books. Three. One, three. two, three. Three books. Book. Oh. Uh, what about the time? Not count. Not count. Not Exactly. The time in general no is non count. What about people? No count. 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 How many people are here? One, two, four. Three. Four two, three, four. Three. Four. four people. Very good. What about butter? Margarita. No, 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 no. It's okay. non count. What about the money? Oh. Bitcoins. No, <laughs> no, the money, money in general is non-count. It's non-count. Money in general is non-count. But if you want to, to infinite. Say, money is non-count. Infinite. But but if you count the bills or the cents, they are count. El dinero en general, dinero, la palabra dinero, money is non-count. Pero si ya usted menciona coins, monedas o billetes, eso sí. Eso sí los puede contar, ¿verdad? Un billete, dos billetes, tres billetes. Yes. No. Igual que la margarina, una barra, no, dos barras. Money. Exactly. But in general, o igual con el azúcar, una libra de azúcar, pero ya utilizamos un quantifier. Una expresión para, ajá, para expresar una cantidad, ¿verdad? Yes. Pero no decimos un azúcar y dos azúcares, azúcares y tres azúcares. No. A menos que hablemos de los tipos de azúcar, que como la sacamos. Que el agua. Dos, ahí es otra cosa. The same with the water, exactly. What about the bread? Okay. No count. Why, teacher? <laughs> but in yes. English, in English, in English, bread in general is non count. 
in English. Oh, Por eso ok, no. ok, ok. In, in English, they don't, okay. I mean, in America, okay. they don't have, ellos no tienen el pan francés como nosotros. Ellos usan <ríe> este tipo de pan, miren este, ¿eh? Para nosotros no... el pan francés ah, okay. no podemos comer. El pan de ellos es diferente. Ajá, ellos usan una, ¿cómo le llaman? Al love of bread. Love of bread. Sí, sí, chavacán. And you can take a piece of bread. Right? Es que aquí no solo compran que... cinco por la cora. De... Mi... Va, entonces aquí de las palabras que tengo arribita vamos a hacer la lista en su cuadernito, ¿verdad? Vamos a escribir cuáles son counts y cuáles son non-counts. Ahí los dibujitos les va a ayudar. Pero hay más. Por ejemplo, I, I wrote here pizzas, books, people. people Tortillas, esas sí las podemos contar, ¿verdad? How many tortillas do you eat every day? Alfredo. Hey, hey, hey. Wow. Son buenos wow. para la masa. One tortilla. I don't Only one. You. Uh, Maybe me, but not you. Yes. 35 no, centavos. No, 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 no. I eat three. Three tortillas. Okay, what three about tortillas. pupusas? How many pupusas do you eat? Two pupusas. Three pupusas in the morning. Three. Every day. Three. Two. Yes. Two. Well, well, only. Right now, I am on a diet. And last night, I just, all, I only ate three. <laughs> <laughs> but I, when my mom makes pupusas, I usually eat four, four or even five, <laughs> because my mom them. made some delicious pupusas. Medium or extra large, teacher? <laughs> Medium. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the same happens with the tacos. De las locas. De a dólar. Ah. Ok, ¿qué más? Computers. Count. Yes, es count. Cell phones. Right. Tomatoes. Count. 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 How many tomatoes can you buy with one dollar? Uh. Ten tomatoes. It depends, right? If you buy them in the market or, or in the tiendita, because in the tiendita they are more expensive. In the grocery store or in the supermarket. In supermarket it is very expensive too. Very expensive too. Maybe you can buy only like three tomatoes for one dollar. <laughs> In the mercado, the street is very cheap. Oh, exactly, in the market, very cheap. I in the bus. In the, in the, in the, in the street. I usually go the mercado food. You buy the food on the market? Yeah, they are more, I mean, they are cheaper. They are cheaper. Yes. In the street. Ah, thank you. Thank you, Cristina. Restaurants are countable. Because you can count one restaurant, two restaurants. Countable. They are count. Four restaurants. Five restaurants. Restaurants. Now, what about here? The non count we have the rice, the sugar, water, the water, the time, the butter, People. the beans, butter, the, the time is non count. Así, el tiempo en general is non count. 
Pero si ya habla de minutos, horas, segundos, eso sí se pueden contar. Only that. <laughs> ah, Domingo dice the fruit. Ajá, uh -huh. fruit is non count. Así, hablando de la fruta en general. Carlos dice de San, ajá, también la arena. Muy bien. De San. Salt. De sal también, salt. Excelente. Oil. De hoy en el aceite. Oh, oh. No, hombre, si ustedes ya te van a dar la clase, si ya se saben esto. Pan comido, esa piece of cake. Se me hace que me no, hicieron. <laughs> okay, good guys. It makes it more interesting. Now, ¿ya copiaron la listita? Yes. No. Ay, Dios, se durmieron, pues. Ahí está Alfredo, miren, primero que se está durmiendo. <laughs> Capturado, dice. Ya lo vi. <laughs> Tony. Okay, now guys, look at this. This is very important. Please pay full attention. With count nouns, we use the, this word, many. We use many to indicate a big quantity. También podemos usar too many para indicar muchos, 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 demasiado. Y luego usamos un plural noun, for example, many people or too many people. Many men, for example, in this class, there are many men, there are more men than women in this class, in this group. We have cars, El Salvador has too many cars. That's why they get a lot, there is a lot of traffic every day. Sandwiches, we can say Domingo ate Four sandwiches in the party. Hey, sandwiches. Yeah, he was very hungry. Uh, we can say Fatima had a lot of DVDs of Backstreet Boys. No, just kidding, Fatima. Uh, ours, um, let's say Alba sleeps nine hours every day. Children, David has two children. And the newspapers right here. Uh, we can say Amilcar reads three newspapers, three different newspapers every day. Okay? It's true. <laughs> And that's true. <laughs> yes. You read La Prensa, El Diario, y El Más. <laughs> And Facebook. <laughs> yes, no. or Twitter. In the yes. paper, uh, in the first, the first activity in the morning in the workplace. Nice. <laughs> so you can see here that we can count these things: one, two, three sandwiches. How many? How many newspapers are here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 14, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. How many cars? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 cars. Mm -hmm. Okay, so these are with count nouns. They can be singular or they can be plural. Nine cars. Nine cars. Ya ven, ya no puedo contar. So, yeah, okay, nine cars. <laughs> Thank you. Now, 
With known count nouns, con los que no se pueden contar, we use much. Much. Or too much. Plus the noun in singular form. For example, salt. Don't put much salt in your food. Or debt. Como la deuda. ¿verdad? He has a big debt. Or the time. Eh, I spend a lot of time in the bathroom. Or water. Eh, I eat, no, sorry, I drink much water. Money, I don't have any money. I'm poor. Sugar, eh, don't put much sugar in your coffee. Breakfast, I had a big breakfast. Or nice. Or oh, I put this picture because it represents low. Love is also uncountable. You cannot measure love. You cannot count the love, right? You can ask, how much do you love me? Please tell me, sweetie, how much do you love me? Oh, I love you so much. I love you to the infinite and more. Now you kidding. Okay, so you cannot count these nouns. For example, you cannot say, give me six waters. We just say water. Okay. Yeah, clear? Uh, like the water or like the orchata? Like the water. Like the orchata. Like the water. Like the water. Clear, clear as the water or clear as the orchara? Orchara. Todavía no. Okay, but I'm going to have it. All is clear, teacher. I'm sorry? All is clear, teacher. Ah, okay, guys. <laughs> ¿Ya, ya tomaron nota? Do you take yeah. notes already? Yes, teacher. ¿Qué iba a decir, Amilcar? Diga. Uh, yes, I think about the people in the world. Is it possible to count to many people? I mean, it's possible. It's possible. Pero, but exactly. Yeah, but people is a count now because you can count the people. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then if you get an exact number, I I don't know. When they say humanidad, la humanidad, el ser humano in the this is like count. Humankind is quizás sería non count. Humankind. Mm -hmm. Ser humano, yes. la humanidad. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um next. How to use countable and uncountable nouns? Okay. We use the word, the question, how much for uncountable? How much does the refrigerator weigh? How much does it cost? How much is the warranty? How much does it storage? Mm -hmm. And they are never plural. How much does the refrigerator weigh? Oh, it weighs a lot. How much does it cost? It costs much money. How much is the warranty? Oh, the warranty is long. How much does it storage? It storages a lot of things. And how many is for the things that you can count? Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, etc. They can be singular or they can be plural. How many features does it have? Features or characteristics? It have a lot of features, but it have many. How many color is this in? In que color hay? How many colors? Oh, you have this cell phone in two colors, black and white. Uh, the speakers are in three colors. 
a light blue, red, and, and gray. How many functions does it have? Oh, my cell phone has a lot of functions, like 20 functions. How many products do you want? I want 1,000 products. Excellent. Now it's time to practice. Aquí tenemos, miren how many and how much. Pueden hacer algunas preguntitas y las ponemos en el chat. Con how many and how much. For example, eh, how many cookies do you eat a week? How many chairs do you have at home? How many tomatoes do you have in your refrigerator? Or how many tomatoes do you need to make a tomato sauce? How many black t-shirts do you have? How much rice do you eat every day? How much cheese do you like in your pupusas? How much tea do you drink? How many oranges? Okay, so please let's make questions and put them in the chat. And I'm gonna be reading your sentences in the chat, okay? Everybody typing in the chat, please. Questions with how many and how much? Todas van a ser por lo menos una con how many y una con how much, por lo menos. And type it. Vaya, Matías, esa sería how much is your t-shirt para preguntar cuánto vale. Pero si quiere usar much is your t-shirt? Okay. Pero también puede ser esta pregunta, mire. How many black t-shirts do you have? ¿Cuántas camisas negras tiene? How much coffee do you drink every day? Excellent, Fatima. I drink two or three cups of coffee. How many oranges can you eat in the, in the week? I can eat a lot of oranges. How many pupusas do you eat in the morning? I eat three. I eat two or three pupusas. It depends the size. How many cups of coffee maybe do you drink per day? Two or three? Ah, how many cups of tea do you drink per day? One cup. Yeah, very good. How much cheese do you need for the green gas? Oh, you need like half a pound. How many chairs do you have in the middle room? Excellent, Magno. How many chairs do you have at home? I have five chairs. How many beds? I don't want the beds from here, but how many beds do you have at home? Uh -huh. yeah. Alba, ¿ahí qué quiere decir? How, much, how many tea rates do you want? ¿Cuántas tazas de té quieres? Uh, how many tea cups? Cups. Tea cups. Uh -huh. How many cookies do you eat every day? Or did you eat today? None. I didn't eat any cookie. How many oranges can you buy with one dollar? <laughs> like four or five only.
Okay, how much is a pound of cheese? How much, how much meat do you eat at week, per week, per week? ¿Cuánta carne come a la semana? How much meat do you eat per week? How, oh, cookies. How many? Porque las cookies sí son contable. How many cookies? Do you cook? Okay. How many blue t-shirts do you have at home? Blue t-shirts, two. How much is your TV? Ah. Para preguntar cuánto vale, sí. Pero si quiere preguntar cuántas tiene, how many TVs do you have? How much soda do you drink? Okay. How much rice do you put to your soup beans? Your bean soup. How many chairs do we need for the party? Very good. ¿Cuánto arroz quiere en su sopa de frijoles? How much does a pound of meat cost? How many pipes of, uh, how many pounds of cheese does it have? How many tomatoes do you need for the meats? Era types, tipes, tipos, types. How many types of cheese does he have? How many types of cheese does he have? Okay. Thank you, guys. Good ideas. I like it. Okay. Now you have to complete the following questions using how much or how many. Please copy in your notebook. How much or how many? How many? Okay, the number one. How many? How many pieces do I need to sample this? How many? Exactly. How many pieces? ¿Cómo sabemos que es how many? For the pieces. Ah, because pieces I is can plural. Do, uh, you can count uh, the pieces. One piece, two pieces, three pieces, four pieces, five pieces. Uh -huh. So how many pieces do I need to assemble this? Very good. Number two. How much? Para preguntar cuánto vale algo, usamos how much. How much? How much? How much do these books cost? How much do these books cost? Cuánto cuestan o cuánto valen estos libros? Okay, number three. How much? The battery life. Okay, how much the is the life. battery life of this, this computer? Mm -hmm. ¿Cuánto yes. es? Ay, ahí repetí el list. Number four. How many? How many hours? Mm -hmm. How many hours do I charge it? Do I charge it? ¿Cuántas horas lo tengo que cargar? Uh -huh. Money how do much? you have? How much money, how much do, you money do you have? Mm -hmm. In number six. How many gallons? How many gallons of water? Does... How much? No, how many? How many? Porque estamos usando gallons. 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 of water. Mm -hmm. Exactly. How many gallons of water does this need? Very good. And then teacher, teacher. Yes, my Milka. And then... And then when the 
when the um, uh, subject is a plural or, or object is a plural, how many? Because I came to the count. Yeah, you just have to think, Do can I count this or not? And then you will use how many or how much, it depends. But if you want to know how, I mean, the cost or the price of something, you use how much. How much? Mm -hmm. and, uh, and the count is at the plural. Count nouns can be singular or they can be plural. Mm -hmm. And when you make the question, how many you use the plural form? Okay, okay. Siempre va a usar la forma plural para la pregunta how many. Uh -huh. How many students are in this class? Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Thanks. Answer my question. <laughs> how many students are in today's class? 17. 21. 16. 16 because 17 is me. So there are only 16. That means that how many students are missing this class? 16. No, how many students are missing? They are not in the class. How many 12. students are missing? 12. 12. Four. No. Four. Four. Yeah, because the group is uh, there are only 16 connected. Hey, come on, teacher. <laughs> ya ven, tienen que poner a trabajar para que no me duerma. Okay, <laughs> now, ¿Qué le Alfredo? Sí, Alfredo tiene la culpa. Y ahora yo. No, qué barbaridad. <laughs> okay, pongámonos en acción, pues. Okay. Quantifiers, vale, le voy a explicar sobre los quantifiers. Teacher, ¿cuáles voy a usar con los countable? ¿En cuáles mm -hmm. voy a usar con los non-count? Vaya, miren. Con los countable, we use some, que es para decir algo, algo algún, any, many, a few, and a lot of. A few quiere decir unos pocos. A lot yes. of quiere decir un montón. Mucho. Y many quiere decir mucho. Por ejemplo, en countable you can say a chair, una silla, two chairs, dos sillas. A project, two projects. An image, two images, for example. And there are some irregular nouns, like in singular, one person, three people. people. One child, Five children. children. And fish? Fish. Fish is always fish. In singular fish. or in plural. Mm -hmm. fish, now, fish. uncountable. With uncountable, you use some, any, any much, much little, and a lot of. of. ¿Cuál es la diferencia entonces? Que con los countable, miren, se Solo hay una pequeña diferencia. ¿Ya se fijaron? Much, many. Exactly. Con los countable, I use many and I use a few. Pero con los uncountable, I use much and little, little or a little. For example, much water, much air, Little money, I have little money. <laughs> In a lot of information, a lot of knowledge, or little knowledge, or much knowledge. But you can use some phrases, for example, a piece of. A piece of advice. Miren que la palabra advice, que significa consejo, no, es, no se puede pluralizar. Entonces usamos a piece of advice. She gave me a piece of advice. Ella me dio un consejo. O she gave me eh, three pieces of advice. Ella me dio tres consejos. You can also use a member of, an amount of. 
y muchas más phrases, phrases. Por ejemplo, a pound of sugar, una libra de azúcar. O you can say um, a pound of meat, una libra de carne. O you can bottle. say a bottle of water, a bottle of soda, a can of Coca-Cola. Um, a gallon of bottle. milk. Mm -hmm. Muy bien. ¿Puedo continuar? ¿Can I continue? Yes. Pero se fijan que cuál es la, la gran diferencia es many y much. much. A few en little. ¿Es esto? Está bien, fácil ver. Yeah, a few. A few is the comfortable. Mm -hmm. A few pupusas. A few tortillas. Mm. Unos pocos, unos cuantos. Okay, guys, now it's your turn. You're going to ask a partner what his or her company buys and create a questionnaire using how much or how many to know everything about that product. Pero si no quieren hablar de productos, pueden hablar de cosas que sus compañeros tienen o, o de sus hábitos. Por ejemplo, how much water do you drink every day? How many children do you have? Um, how much exercise do you do every week? Mm -hmm. How many hours do you practice English? Etc. Van a escribir 10 preguntas. 5 con how many y 5 con how much. Les voy a poner en grupos. Y luego ahí mismo con sus grupos. Se los, you ask and answer the questions. Las mismas preguntas. Cada quien va a hacer sus propias preguntas. Y luego le pre las hace. Y luego se las, las pregunta a sus compañeros. You ask your partners. ¿Sí? Yes. Yes, teacher. Puede preguntar cualquier cosa con how many y con how much. How many pairs of shoes do you have? Por ejemplo, how many cell phones do you have? Um, how much money do you have? If you have a lot, you can give me some. ¿Verdad que sí? Okay, I have one. How many people work in your team, Salvador? Um, in your team work? Six, six person. Six people. Okay. Six people. Okay. Six people. How many hours do you work every day? Um, eight hours. Okay. Um, do you like to to drink coffee in in the office? Um, I love <laughs> drink coffee. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How many sugar do you use? Ah, so how much sugar? Ah, how much? Do you put, Thank you, teacher. Do you put yeah, in okay. your coffee? Okay. 
Teacher A, ¿cómo se contestaría? Ah, oh, I, uh, I put a lot of sugar. A little? Or little oh, a sugar. Or, oh. I, or I don't put any sugar. A little or a little. Sugar. I sometimes, mm -hmm. I sometimes eh, do not add any sugar to my coffee. I don't like to, to add sugar to my coffee. Yeah, I, I like to, to, to drink it without, without sugar. Uh -huh, without sugar. And Jasmine? No. Jasmine, how much money do you have? <laughs> no, just kidding. We need. <laughs> <laughs> A lot Teacher, of money. Como decir how much? How much money do you spend to travel to work or para transportarse al trabajo para para moverse al trabajo? How much money do you spend mm -hmm. on to, to to go to your work? To go to your work. Ah, okay. Or how, how much, much money do you, do you spend, spend on transportation to go to work? Uh -huh. Ah, it's better. How much do you spend? On transportation to go to work. Okay. Oh, sí, no, no. oh children, they say my children. My children, uh huh. Uh -huh. Niños, nada más, solo niños. O hijos. Ah. hijos. Hijos. Son. How many children do you have? Excuse me. <laughs> Está haciendo las, las con man, hot money. Está preguntando a él, hot money brother you have. How many brothers do you have? You have. Mm -hmm. Very good. Y digo, lo otro era, hot money gain do you have? How many? Gay, juego. Ah, how many video games or ga video games? Video juego? Well, how many? How many? O qué tipo de juegos? Gay, juegos de videojuegos sería gay. Video games. Video. Y, el, y cuando, cuando aparecen en los. En los, en los En las, en las pantallas dice gay cuando aparece gay or games el juego game siempre uh -huh. juego sí porque jugadores y yes, players yes. players game and video game video game es como el el, el, el como el software Del videojuego. Ah, sí. Ajá. Ah, sí. Games. Entonces, sí. Ese es de videojuegos, gay. Games. 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 Or video games. Video games, videojuegos. Ok, I finish. Finish. Nice. Ya, ya escribieron okay. sus preguntas. Y ahora se van yes. a preguntar. Yes. Ok. Yes. For example, uh, Alban, how many people uh, do you work with? Um, hey, people. I work with eight people. 
Uh, how many, please uh, re repeat? A war, a people in the war. Okay. I work a co worker. But I have a co workers. Okay. Um, how many tea cup do you drink? Hello. Hello, teacher. ¿Cómo van? Ya casi es la hora, ¿verdad? Hello. I see that you are practicing with Cristina by chat, and that's good. Where do you live, Amilcar? I live in El in Santa Tecla. I ride in a boquerón. Oh, interesting. Okay, so for the wrap up, guys, I have these questions. Okay, um, can you tell me quickly, for example, number one? How much? Teacher, how much? In the number one, it starts. It starts. How many? How many? How many, How many stars are there in the sky? Uh -huh. ¿Cuántas Why, estrellas hay? Hay en el cielo. Quantifier. Okay, number two. How many, How many people live Se pronuncia islands, no se pronuncia la S con esa. Islands. Island. Island. Number three. How many birds are there? How many birds are there? Okay. Number four. How much water? How much water is in the ocean? Five. How much money? How much money? How much money, How much money is in a bank? Is in a bank. A lot of money. Okay. Number six. How many countries? How many, How many, How many are countries there the are there in the world? Okay, seven. How much? How much? How much bread is eaten per day? Number eight. How many bones are there in the human body? How many bones yeah. are How many? in the human body? Bones. Number nine. How much and ten? How much? How much? How much? How much information is of is on the internet? Very good. How much? And the same here. You have to choose how much or how many. Pero esto lo vamos a dejar for tomorrow. Just tell me here. Money, is it countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Not countable. Uncountable. 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 
Uncountable. Uncountable. Uncountable. Uncountable. Uncountable. Uncountable. Uncountable. Car. Uncountable. 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 And finally, metal. Uncountable. 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 Excellent. Now, guys, I need to take the last attendance. Okay. Only one minute. Alba Dinora. Present. Alfredo Roda. Present. Amil Cañegue. Present. Carlos Gualberto. Present. Teacher. Cristina Romero. Domin Present in the chat. Oh, thank you, Matías. Domingo González. Present. Fátima Portillo. Present. Jose Lemus. Present teacher. David Velasquez. Present. Marlon Cardona. Present. Mauricio Mahan. Present. Maydeli. Present. Está Maydeli. No teacher. Mm, se estaba conectada, quizás tuvo algún problema. Nancy Rodríguez. Yes. Katia Maritza. Salvador Edgardo. Present teacher. Sandra Velázquez. Present teacher. Víctor Salazar Calzadilla. Present. Walter Daniel González Pérez. William Eduardo Pérez. William? No. No está William, pero sí se había conectado, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Jasmine Melan. Jasmine Melan. Ok, thank you. Ok. <ríe> Muy bien, ¿qué aprendimos ahora entonces? What did you learn? How much, today? how much, how many. How much, how many. Countables no. y no countables. No. No, no, no. Only that. And features like size, weight, warranty, functions, dimensions. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, guys. The class is over already. And now and I'm going to share uh, the number. Y que el, el número que me dio es para llamarle o llamar. ¿Cómo sería? You can write to me, okay? Me. Uh -huh. I'm going to stay with Alba, okay? For the 10 minute session. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams for you too. Good night, people. Good night, See good you night. Good night. Press well. Do the homework. Good night, teacher. Good night. Do the homework. Good Don't forget. Night, Bye. Good night, Cristina. Good night. Good night. Good night. Alba. Hi. How are you? Thank you. Yeah. Fine. You're fine. Okay. And your baby? Dormidos. Oh, how many children do you have? Huh? How many children do you have? ¿Cuántos niños tengo? Yeah. Two. Oh, you two. have two children. Yeah. Two boys, two girls, or one boy and one girl? One boy, one girl. Really? And how old is your boy? 
is your son? ¿Cuántos años tiene? Three years. Year. Your three son year. is three years. Mm. And your girl, your, your daughter, how old is your daughter? Uh, eight. She, oh. Huh? How old is your daughter? La dije cuánto tiene, me pregunto. Sí. La dije. Amon. Oh, Amon. She's eight months only. Oh. <laughs> They are very little. Oh. Okay, Alba. Do you have um, questions? Uh, ask me. Mejor. Oh, okay. pregúnteme. Practice. Very good. Sí. That's nice. Okay, um, Alba, let me let me think. Uh, how many brothers do you have? Well, how many four brothers? I have. I have four brothers. I have. <laughs> I have. Really? You have four brothers and how many sisters? Oh, in total. Ah. <laughs> two. I had two brother. I have. I had two sister. Yeah, interesting. I have two brothers and I have one sister. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And um, Alba. Um, I don't know. How many cell phones do you have? How many cell phones? Yes. How many cell phones? Uh, well, I have one cell phone. <laughs> I have one cell phone. <laughs> Only one. Good. Yes. Mm -hmm. Alba, how much exercise do you do every week? ¿Cuántos ejercicios? Oh, ¿qué? ¿Cuánto ejercicio hace cada semana? Uh, solo salgo a caminar. <laughs> ok, pero... But... <laughs> yeah, but... <laughs> It's exercise. <laughs> so I make one hour a week. And the, in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. And. ¿Cómo se dice todos los días? Every day. Every day. Okay, nice. Very good. Um. Let me see. Do you like cooking? Um, yes. Okay. Uh, si me gustan las galletas, me preguntó. No. Sí. Yes. Do you like Ah, uh, si cocino. Yes. Uh, um, Santay. Okay. <laughs> how many how many pounds of beans do you cook every week? How many pounds of beans do you cook every week? Pounds no comprendo. Pounds se refiere a libras. ¿Cuántas libras? No, beans. ¿Cuántas libras de frijoles? How many pounds oh. of beans oh. do you cook every week? Four. In Four. The week. Four pounds of beans, a lot. Mm -hmm. Is your family big or small? Big. Is X big? Okay, nice. 
Okay. How many tortillas did you eat today? One. Only one. In lunch, one. Mm. Um, For dinner? Con el... For ah. dinner? A dinner? I dinner one también. Okay. I ate one at dinner. Okay, so in total, you ate two tortillas per day. Yes. Two. <laughs> How many pairs of shoes do you have? How many pairs? What person? How many pairs of shoes do you have? Cuántos zapatos? Yes. How many pairs of shoes do you have? Oh. Oh. I saw it. Um, Twenty shoes. Twenty pairs <laughs> of shoes. Sí. Oh my goodness, you have a lot of shoes. <laughs> okay, Alba, how many dresses do you have? Dresses? Dresses. No, no comprendo dresses. Vestidos. Vestidos. Oh. How many dresses do you have? I have... Two. Two dresses. No, no, tengo de noche, two, no, ten, five. Five dresses. Five, five sets, please. Five or six dresses, okay. Nice. Okay, how many rooms does your house have? How many rooms does your house have? How many rooms does your house have? But rooms, no, no. Rooms. ¿Cuántos cuartos o habitaciones oh. does your house have? I have, I have three rooms. Three rooms. Okay. Nice. Nice for you. Okay. Alba, how many hours do you sleep every day? Or I, or I sleep. I sleep. <laughs> I sleep some eleven. Or really, you you sleep eleven hours a day? Yes. You sleep a lot. I barely sleep six or seven hours. <laughs> okay, Alba. ¿Cómo se siente con este tema? Pues difícil, difícil. No está solo que el, el palabritas que desconozco y que todavía me falta que aprender el vocabulario. Pero este tema no está tan complicado que se diga. Sí, eso. está más está comprensible. Ok, qué mm -hmm. bueno, qué bueno saber eso. Bueno, sí. Alba, ya llegamos a las 10 y 10, pero fue un gusto poder compartir estos minutos con usted. Cualquier duda, Thank pregunta, you. comentario, sugerencia, ya sabe que estamos abiertos a escucharle, ¿verdad? Ok. Ok, Alba, have a good night. Good night. Good night.